Good morning, guys. Welcome back to Mornings with Granny. I hope you're having a good weekend. It is hard to believe it is the weekend again. My grandson was 14 yesterday. It's just hard to believe he is that age. Time has passed so fast. All right, guys, it's time for the stock up again for $5. Now, this week I went to Bilo's, and I'm going to show you what I bought. I spent $5.09. I had $5.05 because I had $0.05 cents left from my Food Lion shop. So I picked up a can of mixed vegetables, and this is a 15-ounce can. It was $0.70. Cents. They had the tomatoes, buy one, get one free. So I bought two cans, and they were 28 ounces each, $1.99 for both cans. And then I bought the chili mix. It was marked down to 67 cents, and the regular price on it was $2.69. And then some good old peanut butter, and it was on sale for $1.74. And this is a, let me see the size, 16.3 ounce. All right. Let's go over what I bought here and why I bought it. Now, you know I've bought pinto beans. That was one of my first shops. So, if you take tomatoes and use some of the pinto beans and a little of this chili seasoning, you could have some Mexican beans. Or you could take the tomatoes, the chili seasoning, add pinto beans, and add some of the chicken that we bought. Or you could make soup by using tomatoes and some mixed vegetables. You could take the tomatoes. You can make spaghetti sauce by adding some seasoning to it. You can make pizza sauce with it. You could just make plain old tomato soup. There's plenty of things you could do. You could use this chili seasoning to season meat and bake your meat or fry it, however you cook it. And then peanut butter. I just like peanut butter. Mom likes to just take a spoonful and eat each day. I like it on crackers. Or if you eat bread, you could put it on a slice of bread and make a sandwich. Peanut butter is just good to have. But that's why I bought what I bought. It was a good price, and it ties into the previous stuff I bought. So let's go over the breakdown of it. Okay. Now the chili mix was $0.67. Cents. The mixed vegetables, I'm going by the serving size on the side of the can. And if you go by that, it was 3.5 servings. The can cost $0.70. Cents. That's about 20 cents a serving. The tomatoes, I just added together 13 servings in each can. So that's 26 servings, $1.99 for both cans. That's about eight cents a serving. The peanut butter was $1.74. It has 14 servings. That's about 12 cents a serving. Spent $5.09, I'm four cents over. Now let's recap what we have so far in our stock up. So far we have six one pound bags of pinto beans, a bottle of hand sanitizer, we have five cans of chicken, we have three packs of wipes, we have one bottle of detergent, another bottle of hand sanitizer, now we have chili mix, mixed vegetables, tomatoes, and peanut butter. So I hope you guys are stocking up with everything that's going on. You just never know. Um, this virus and the floods and everything, food prices could go up. Maybe they won't, but I feel like they will. And look at it this way. If you spend two, five, ten dollars a week stocking up, nothing happens then that means in about four or five weeks, you can skip a week. You don't have to buy groceries. So that would be good. I don't know why this thing got so blurry. There you go. All right, guys, let's look at some mail that I received. This is from Tommy in California. Thank you. And this is from my friend in Ohio. Thank you. 
And I received this from, it says David in Kansas. This pretty kitchen towel. And some notepads. I can always use these. I like to keep these in my pocketbook and also in the car. And then I received this from Kathy in California. She sent me a birthday card. Thank you. It's hard to believe my birthday's, let's see, next Thursday. And then Mom's is on the 3rd. My grandson's, like I said, it was yesterday. So we got three birthdays close together there. And I want to say a special hello to Makimi in Israel. I was glad, glad that I heard from you yesterday. And also a special hello to Leslie in New York, to Janelle at Parsnips and Parsimony, and to Rhoda Stone. Hi, Rhoda. I hope your day is going great. I hope you have a great weekend. Stay safe, folks. Stay well and stock up. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Have it subscribe, subscribe, and please tell your friends. Bye-bye.